where I also find the Jacobian for x equals u squared plus seven uv and y equals six uv squared. Because we have x and y expressed in terms of u and v, the Jacobian is equal to the determinant of the two by two matrix where the entries in row one are the partial of x with respect to u and the partial of x with respect to v and the entries in row two are the partial of y with respect to u and the partial of y with respect to v. And we use a notation shown here on the left for the Jacobian. So the Jacobian is equal to the determinant of the two by two matrix where the entry in row one, column one, again is the partial of x with respect to u and since x equals u squared plus seven uv, we differentiate u squared plus seven uv with respect to u, treating v as a constant, which gives us two u plus seven v. The entry in row one, column two, is the partial of x with respect to v, so now we differentiate u squared plus seven uv with respect to v, now treating u as a constant. The derivative of u squared with respect to v is zero, then we have plus the derivative of seven u v with respect to v, which is seven u, since the derivative of v with respect to v is one. And now the entry in row two, column one, is the partial of y with respect to u, and since y is equal to six u v squared, we differentiate six u v squared with respect to u, treating v as a constant, which gives us six v squared. And then finally, the entry in row two, column two, is the partial of y with respect to v, so now we differentiate six u v squared with respect to v, treating u as a constant, which gives us 12 u v. And now to find the Jacobian, we evaluate the two by two determinant, which is equal to the product of two u plus seven v and 12 u v, minus the product of seven u and six v squared. So again, we have the quantity two u plus seven v times 12 u v, and then minus the product of seven u and six v squared. Now we multiply and simplify. Distributing 12 u v, we have 24 u squared v, and then plus 12 u v times seven v, which is 84 u v squared. And then we have minus 42 u v squared. In the final step, we combine like terms. We have 24 u squared v, and then 84 u v squared minus 42 u v squared is equal to 42 u v squared, giving us plus 42 u v squared. So given x equals u squared plus seven u v, and y equals six u v squared, the Jacobian is 24 u squared v plus 42 u v squared. We will use a Jacobian when performing a change of variables to evaluate a double integral, which will make the double integral easier to evaluate. I hope you found this helpful.